What's up you guys, Martin here and welcome to Vlogtober Day 3. <laughs> As you guys can tell, I'm really excited. I just got my pre-order from Big Bad Toy Store. Um, let's just let's talk about how pristine this box looks. I'm really stoked about it. I'm in my bedroom right now. I really don't film in here just because of the lighting. I have this camera balancing on a on a contraption I made, but I really wanted to make this because it's Vlogtober Day 3. And you guys know how I am every October. I make a video every day. Sometimes the videos would be short, sometimes the videos would be long. It's just you get what you get. You're gonna see me every day. Vlogtober, baby. I'm gonna show you guys my collection of Boglins. I made a couple of unboxings um, last year, and since I was little, I always wanted Boglins, but my mom couldn't afford the Boglins growing up. You know, she was a mother of three. We, sh we didn't have a lot. My mom did the best she could, but I've always wanted Boglins, but they decided to come back with Boglins, and they created so many, and yeah, some people are saying like, oh my god, they're the same Boglin, they're just different color schemes. True, but it's still fun, and I'm digging it. It doesn't bother me like that. Um, I did get my Halloween ones, I'm really excited about that, so let's just pan out right here. So as you guys can see, I have the Halloweens, I got the clown, I got the pumpkin, I got the ba ba uh, bones, I got the aliens, I got the clown, the other version of the clown, I got the new ones, Toper, I got King Wart, I got the originals, I got the reds, the golds, the, I got them all, okay, and they all glow in the dark, which is the best thing ever, but you guys, but this right here has two new bat boglins that were never available. But of course, it's perfect because it is a vlogtober. It is October. It's the month of Halloween. So I got the two new bat boglins plus a brand new one. And I can't think of his name right now. I'm blinking. But we're going to open it and we're just going to see. I had this pre-ordered a long time ago. And they're finally here. Um, if you guys are going to order boglins, I'm telling you right now. Go to Big Bad Toy Store. I cannot stress this enough. I made some videos like I just mentioned. I bought the gold horned uh, Boglins. They were a Walmart exclusive. It came like crap. The boxes were all bent. It was horrible. Um, just don't. Don't get from Amazon. Don't get from Walmart. Don't get from Target. Go to BigBadToyStore.com. I'm telling you right now. I can't stress that enough. Uh, it is the best. The box. There should be three in here. And there are three. Um, first of all, look at how freaking great this packaging is. Can you see that? Really, really, really good packaging. They have bubbled wrapped everything. So I'm going to just go ahead and put this box next to me. And I'm just going to pull out a random one. I don't really know which one we're going to look at first, but we're going to do it. All right. I'm sorry about the lighting, you guys. It is late o'clock at night, so bear with me. First, we do get a sticker, a Big Bad Toy Store sticker. Uh, yes, please. Um, this will be on my sticker door. All right. King Spunk. Ooh, he looks really good. I'm already liking him. It's freaking adorable, actually. Look how cute, you guys. He's, like, way in the back. He's like, oh, my God. His coloring is really nice. It's like an orange, yellowish tan. I am loving him. I am absolutely loving King Spunk. Oh, man, this is so cool. They did fix up the way they come in. The first Boglins that rolled out, they didn't have this plastic film on top. Now they do, so it doesn't get dusty. And hopefully it doesn't have that horrible plastic backing that you're going to wrap to rip the box or rip the the boglin all right so i open the side it teaches you how to open the boglin correctly just be careful so slide that out all right you get the instructions on how to assemble the boglin i ain't doing this for every box i'm just showing you guys the, 
the setup because I know you guys want to see these things and I don't want to be like showing you all this. So this will be the setup and I'm going to cut down to the bag ones, the rest of them. So this is King Spunk. It tells you about your king. It's really cool. They all have like a little thing. Um, I'm not going to read this. Maybe someone else that are that's reviewing it on YouTube will read it. I just don't want to read that. You get the tail and the pieces. Okay. So let's get this bad boy out. They did they did make him way easier to get out. Now you just have to unravel him, which I'm telling you right now, the best way to do it. And if you don't believe me, go look at people opening it. Thank goodness, like I kind of got the idea quick and I could pop them out really easy, but a lot of people had a really hard time doing it. Oh man, he's cool. Oh, he's oh he's chunky too. His hands, look how they're chunky chunk. They have like a different kind of texture on these. Hope you're gonna be able to see. Look at the texture. He's cool looking. Oh wow, he's really really cool. He's different. He's definitely different. Um, he's just more of like in your face, like your palm. The other ones are like more of like this. He's more like this. So it's kind of hard for me to control him a little bit. I just have to take the time to learn. Really, really cool. He's cute as shit. I'm not going to lie. I really like him. Um, how does his tail look? Oh, it's a definitely a different looking tail. Looks like a lobster tail, almost. You're going to get the plastic part. You're going to put it inside right there. Again, I'm only doing this one time. Oh, he's cute. He's cute as shit. And it's going to look like this. All right? Then, you're going to place that into the holes right there. Just like that. And then make sure all of them are in. Then you're going to grab this bad boy and you're going to snap it into place from the inside. Just like that. Now you have a full box. Wow, it's really weird though. It's, okay, well, actually, it's just, I'm not used to the tail like up, 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 but he's great. He looks really, really cute. I like him. He's a chunky man. He's a chunky man. Chunky man. Uh, the, I feel like this lighting is really horrible, you guys. I'm sorry. His eyes are just straight up orange, which is great. Um, love his horns. I love him. This is King Spunk. Welcome to the family, King Spunk. <laughs> Let's grab this one first. Ooh, I haven't even seen these yet in person, and here we go. All right, he looks sad. The first flight. Ooh. This is Vlad. The box is completely different. It looks more like stone. Um, I'm loving it. Um, looks like little bats everywhere. Did you hear that scree screech last night? So this is Vlad, all right? Look at him. Look how freaking awesome. It's gonna be hard to look. But do you see him? He's just chilling. Looks like blood. So let's open this bad boy up. Okay, this guy comes with a lot of stuff. And uh, I, I mean a lot. So here he is. And then you have all this for the, the bat bogs. Um, it's probably going to be self, very self-explanatory. Um, basically the same way that the tail, I'm, if they have a tail, but I'm assuming it's going to be the same way. So don't worry. Don't get overstressed. Don't get uh, stressed out. Like, oh my God, I'm not going to be able to figure it out. Because you will. Um, these ones don't have the plastic on the bottom. They're just the zip tie, which is fine by me. And then the box in the back says lots of trick or, tricks, no treats. Really love that. He's I like his colors. 
Um, I love the eyes. But my only thing is, I wish they gave him, like, vampire teeth. Do you know what I mean? They're giving him the same kind of teeth as the other ones. Um. But I like him. I mean, I like the color. The red, the purples. The eyes are really freaking awesome on these. Right? This is easier to control than Spunk. Than the one I just showed you guys. This one's just easier. Do you see how it's like... I can do more with it. Alright, so let's try to get this bad boy up. Um, the directions. <coughs> kind of weird. It looks like they're saying to put the plastic on the inside and then the pla hard plastic on the outside. Very vague um, directions. All right, we have three. We have o Orlock, Vlad, and Drac. I don't think or Orlock is out yet because I would have pre-ordered him. Um, but here's the little info on them. Really cool. All right, let's get into this. Let's do the tail first. Okay, classic Boglin tail. I don't hate it. I love the colors. It matches him, the purple and the red. Love that. So we're gonna go ahead and do this because we already know how to do this. Um, you got two small pieces. You got one big piece. This is for the tail, these are for the wings. And then you do have three sets of the plastic holders. Nice. Look at that freaking wing. Whoa. That is freaking awesome. Cool. All right, so we're gonna do the same thing with this. Let's see, this is kind of confusing me, I'm not gonna lie. So the plastic goes in, okay, so yeah. Plastic goes inside. That makes, oh yes, it makes sense, watch, so. The plastic part goes inside like this, right? Inside his body for his arm. After you get that done, you are going to... The wings have a little slit in the back. Okay? So what's going to happen is you're going to grab this. You're going to slip this into here. Okay? Stretch that in. Oh, yeah. That feels right. Perfect. And then it's like a slip cover for this part. Okay? So now you're just gonna plop it in to that. You're gonna connect it. Make sure it's on the right arm. And you're gonna pop it in. Just like that. Whoa! I'm really excited. Okay, let's put the other one in. All right. Wow, this actually feels really good. Like, really good. There's his wings, and there he is. Oh, he feels good. He is heavy, but he has a... Look how cool that is. He has a nice weight to him, though. I feel like it balances the entire movement of the puppet. Oh, my God. Oh, man. He is looking fantastic. The veins on the wings. Like, you guys, come on now. Yes! Next up.
So really quick, I love how the, it looks like a cave. It's basically, I just, I don't know why I'm just putting up, putting together the pieces. It looks like stone. It's like a little bat cave. And then this is the door for the bat cave. Like that's the bat cave, like that. It's freaking awesome. Putting him in this is kind of difficult. Ooh, ooh, I don't know about this. Just, whoa, it's, it's, you kind of have to be careful. It's not a wide enough hole. Like you really have to kind of just shove him in there, which I don't like that part. But I mean, it'll do. See, it's gonna be hard to position him because he's not. I'm really weird like that. Like I like them to be. Now I just like kissing the wall. Next up. All right, the last one for this pre-order, you guys. So we just unboxed King Spunk. Awesome. We unboxed King Vlad, or Bat Boglin Vlad. Bat Boglin Vlad. Looks great. Love the wings. Love the feel of it. I think the feel of it is the most impressive um, out of all the Boglins I have right now. All right, for sure. So we got uh, Bat Blog. It's, it's Bat Boglin Vlad. Next up, we have Drac. All right, Bat Boglin Drac. He's more of a reddish black blue. Let's get into it. All right, there he goes. He has all the, look how cool that looks. That's freaking awesome. He has the wings, he looks great. Black and red look really good with him. I'm pretty stoked. Love it. There you have it, the two brand new Bat Boglins. They look amazing, they feel great on your hand. Perfect for Vlogtober, perfect for Halloween, perfect for unboxing for you guys. <sighs> I love it. We have Vlad, and we have Drac, and we have King Spunk, okay? So you guys, again, See how this one I'm telling you guys how it's like really flat and then this one's easier. Uh, bah, what are you looking at? Don't eat on my tail. Don't call it a lobster. I'm watching you. I'm watching you all. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, favorite, share it to friends and family for more content. And until next time, you guys, don't be a lemon. Be a rosebud. Peace.